going to turn Dana Washington down? Yeah, and uh, yeah, I think I need to. First time I was going into this room, I was a little bit afraid of this one, but uh, you you get used to him. Get used to him. But you didn't see that one. Oh no! Now I see. In today's episode, how do you do into welcome? So the sun is shining. I woke up, so I just thought I might go for a bike ride, and then I buy some groceries, and then I come home, and then I won't leave my house for. Days, because we are off three days now. I might even go on my cross trainer, which I haven't touched this month. By the way, I will be wearing my new glasses, sunglasses from Dollar Store. Looking snazzy. Oh my God. Hello. Last week I did lots of things, so uh, plays and exhibitions and lectures and stuff. This week I'm, I'm off for three days and I'm planning to do nothing. Just stay at home, chilling, cleaning, I don't know, pretend that it's a weekend. Look, I'm not sure, but this might be a shirt I donated, because I donated this shirt, or a shirt like this recently. So it's time to go shopping. So today I will be making something called cheeseburger pasta. Look at that. It looks great. I will also be making this Asian tofu with crushed cucumber. Believe me, this is all I need for two meals, two sort of recipes, eight portions. Because I've got everything else at home. There is this Asian supermarket at my, in my mall and I realised that their tofu is so much cheaper, it's redonkidonk. So I'm going to, there to buy some tofu and maybe some other things, I don't know. It's kind of scary because I don't know what to use stuff for, so I can't really go sort of, a, well, have this and this and this, I, I really need a recipe. So, I mean, this. 400 grams of tofu. It's like they're giving it away. And look at these. Don't you get curious what to use them for? I'm about to do something really scary. Well, not really. You remember last week when I was at the, no, Saturday, when I was at the bike repair man and I thought, oh, I thought, oh no, I might as well give my bike a tune up and change tires and let him do all that. And I think today is the day I'm gonna leave my bike there. And the scary part is that I really like to be able to sort of jump on my bike and go anywhere. And if I leave it at the bike repair man, I can't do that. I'm sort of stranded at home, which is good. So don't argue with me. Look at that sky, not a cloud, which I hope is a good thing. So, oh, they're building something, I don't know. So this is a great bike shop. I uh, use them a lot. So this is my hood. Okay, people, this cheeseburger pasta is so good. I just paid four portions. It's so good. You make this sort of the, the like the meat saucy thing is made from sunflower seeds. If you want, you can take a snap of this it's really good and it's really easy to do you just heat this up people remember them when I said I dreaded uh, being without a bike well he just called four hours later and said it's fixed I can pick it up so I don't know what how, how should I be dramatical now everything is good so I'm walking but soon I will be rolling already got my bike new tires and new in, uh, inner tubes and my this thing here the brake fixed fantastic oh, surprise Martin is coming over not that Martin that Martin is coming over he's never been to my apartment and it looks like 
I've been burglarized. No, it doesn't look like I've been burglarized. Yes, it looks like I've been burglarized by burglars who just move stuff around, don't steal anything. They just sort of put things temporarily in strange places. So, um, yeah, I'm getting a visitor. Hej. Hej, välkommen. Tack så mycket. Kom in. Tack så mycket. Ja. Första intrycket på engelska. Eh, it's like, uh, what do you say? Uh, it's very, a lot of colors, a lot of, uh, what do you say, posters, a lot of inspirational uh, pictures and so on. It's going to turn Dana Washington down. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. I think I need to. First time I was going into this room, I was a little bit afraid of this one, but uh, you you get used to him. Yes, used to him. But you didn't see that one. Oh no! Now I see. But do you have some names on them? No. No. Okay, it's a little bit uh, fantastic apartment, but a little bit odd. But uh, it's like like we call it in Sweden, Julkalendern. You yes. can see something in every corner. You can see a little man. You can see a little house, and you can see like. Things. You didn't. You haven't seen the man in the table. Ah, oh, okay. <laughs> Look, I got this. So he said, "Open it," and I said, "No, let's open something else because I've I've got loads and loads of wine. So this one will be saved. It's like it's like a sort of s statue." What's being ordered now? Hmm, a glass bottle. Really? Yeah. Det är ett stort glas vin då. Ja. <laughs> Och så har vi lagat mat? Ja, vi har lagat mat. Vad har vi lagat för något? Det är det thailändskt, det är det. Ja. Med tofu. Mm. Med bland annat lite, lite, det är vitlök, det är chili. Det är faktiskt bankad gurka, eller kavlad gurka. Jag har ja. aldrig kavlat gurka innan, ja. så det, det var intressant. Med ris kokade i 20 minuter. Mm. Och vad är det mer för någonting? Det är också charlottenlök. Mm. Fräser det här tills det får lite färg, men vi hade lite svårt om att kan tofu få färg, så då la vi på lite soja och lite blandat. Ja. Och agavesirap. Du kan ju. Mm. Smaka. Mm, det är som man gör i tv. Hur smakar det då? Oh, fy fan. Mm, vad gott det var. Nu går, vi, nu går vi över till Rikram. Vad håller vi på med nu? Vi bokar nu biljetter. Till oh, in English, please. We now book tickets for... Uh, Monday all the week. I don't know if that is the right. <laughs> <laughs> Groundhog Day. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I Karlsta. Värmland Opera. Ja, uh, Värmland Opera. Uh, so we have looked here some different kinds of uh, days. days and shows. And we take a matinee show. Yeah. The, the 22nd of March. And uh, we're going to book it now. Yeah. So uh, they're going to have uh, opening night the 27th of February. So it's on two three days. Yeah. Yep. It's going to be interesting. So <laughs> Martin... Snälla, ta bort mig. Martin has never heard of Follies. <laughs> and he has never heard of the songs in Follies. And still he calls himself, I like musicals. Mm. Yes, this, this. But you heard of Stephen Sondheim, right? Yeah, of course. I've seen Stephen Sondheim alive and kicking. You have? Yes, in oh. London, in West End. Oh. When I was there with Marcus Virta. Oh. Some, some uh, ten years ago. Yes. <laughs> and you didn't say anything about Follies then? No. So, so, so <laughs> tell me one song from Follies. Nej. <laughs> so, 